we're rich. There's over ten thousand dollars here. I can see it all now. Come tomorrow, I'm gonna be like Mr. Barnes. I ain't coming to work today, tomorrow, or the day after that. Harlem, here I come. Are you that stupid? Your boss, Mr. Barnes, is dead, and so are we if we keep that money. Who cares if Domino is dead? He was a corrupt club owner who peddled smack. Not to mention he tried to rape me. I hope the devil is sticking a pitchfork in his evil black ass right now. Anyway, come to mama. Are you fully that stupid? Don't nobody give you something for nothing, let alone $10,000 at that. Now what did we just see? What the hell did we just see? A man got shot three times and got right back up. What kind of cat does something like that? A pretty powerful one. No. Whoever this Mississippi black character is, oh, best he believe he's coming back. And when he does, we're going to be here. So do me a favor. Pack your things, get your stuff, leave the money here, let's get the first train to Harlem. Besides, we'll be fine to the auditions anyway. But what if we don't make it? And don't be getting all high and mighty on me now, Trip. You were locked up for five years. Do you know how hard it was for me to keep my head up, keep going to work every single night in a sleazy club, fighting off a man every night, including my boss, Mr. Barnes? Please, this money is mine. Stash that gravy. Come on, put the, put the money away. Come on, baby, put, put the money away. Come on now. and murder, your name came to mind. Trip, I hope you're not enjoying this, because that sure would take all the fun out of it. Well, if it isn't, step it and fetch it. Did anyone ever tell you when you come into their home, you address them? Ma'am? Spunky, I see why you two are matched the way you are. A punk and his overbearing wife. Hmm. Now, Club Domino went up in flames last night, and his owner was burnt to a crisp. Now, I know you two were there, so talk. My husband came to pick me up from work. Nothing more. What happened once we left is not our concern. It's yours. So you can take your five and dime suits and your tired run over shoes and get the hell up out of my house! <laughs> you know, I love that spunk. You know, I don't use it on hit women, but I will smack a bitch. Excuse you? You feeling brave, boy? Huh? You feeling brave? Well, sit down, boy. Now, the evidence that we saw fit the pattern and the profile of a notorious outlaw named Mississippi Black. Now, does that name ring a bell, boy? Mississippi Black? Who that? Mississippi Black, a.k.a. the Black Terror. He's one in five states for murder, arson, and extortion. He robs them, he murders them, and leaves nothing but ashes and happy poor folks in his wake. And this guy, he coming back. And when he does, I want to know when and where he's going to strike. You know what? You're going to go undercover for the department. Mm -hmm. Do I make myself clear? No, because I got plans to be somewhere else. Oh, oh, you do? Yes, I do. Hey, hey, all you guys and gals with the blowing pipes. Come and frisk your whiskers at an audition Monday, August 8th. You thinking about leaving? You taking the A train to Harlem, boy? Huh? You know, I will have every cop from here to Harlem looking for your ugly face, and a lot of them ain't colored. So they don't care about a shiftless nigga like you. Do I make myself clear? Y'all heard my wife. What happened after we left is your concern, not ours. Yeah? Yeah, that's right. How about a night in prison to make you go talk? Hmm? Get to the get him. Get him. Get him. Hey, hey! Get him. 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 Get
Yeah. I'm glad you're home. Shoot, the way things are going, might be leaving again. What's that for? Don't be talking like that. You're not going anywhere. Well, we sure as hell are. Because them pounders got to be crazy think I'm going to work with them. Now pack your stuff and let's go. Okay. Come on now, let's go! Yeah. Oh, okay. I'll go pack. Hey, 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 hey. Can you, uh, give me a drink? Mary Jane! Hey, baby! You okay? What's wrong? Wake up! Baby! What's that smell? Opportunity. So you found me. But how'd you get in here? I know things must have looked kind of funny back there. Funny? You know, you look real good for a cat to get three shots in the body. Now tell me, how'd you get in here? I will. In time. See, what happened to that feisty wife of yours? You know, I don't know. I got the feeling you about to tell me, right? Oh, you think I would hurt your wife? She's so sweet. Let's cut to the chase. What do you want? Chance to lay my rap on you. I'm listening. You want me to sit? I'm cool standing right here. Well, let me pour your coattail to this, Daddy Yo. In any community, you got two types of people. You got your colors and your niggas. Me, I'm colored. But you, you's a nigga. But I'm here so you can change all that. I gave you $10,000. Now what you gonna do with it? So let me get this straight. You rob a man. You kill that man. You burn a frolic pad and you say, I'm a nigga. I don't want your gravy. As a matter of fact, stay stashed right there while I go get it. I don't need it, Seymour. You keep it, but you use it wisely. And thanks to me, Spider won't be putting that money in his pockets. It's what? But you killed him or something? No. But it's two flunkies? Yeah, I squashed them like a bug. Like I said, I don't want you gravy. As a matter of fact, I don't want to be around you. So do me a favor and just leave. Tomorrow night, I'm taking down Sweet Tooth and that filthy flesh pot they call the Sugar Shack. That's real groovy, man. Groovy. You have a horrible won't you drop me a line and just tell me how it went, all right? Why would I do that when you're going to be right there beside me? What? I know what you do, Seymour. You're a lie, a cheat. Don't even get me started on you're still in the gamut. You're a disgrace. A disgrace to color folks everywhere. You saw this one right here. I am color folks everywhere because there ain't no jobs. Now, you tell me where's the satisfaction in cleaning the place you can't get us to unless you got a mop and a damn bucket. I got a roof over my head. I got food on my table. And I got clothes on my damn back. So who cares where that money came from? Oh. Oh, but like, like you said, right? You just everybody's favorite Negro, right? That's what you are? If not that, I'm close to it. You walk down those ghettos. You hear the folks whisper my name. Richmond. Baltimore, Wilmington, down Philadelphia. 
before I showed up, color folks were in a bad situation. I got rid of them niggas, and I left the colors behind. This is my mission. This is my goal. What if I told you I don't want to? What if I told you that? What if I told you I'd kill you? What? I could have killed you so many times in the past. I chose to let you live. The past? Nigga, I just met you. What you talking about the past? <laughs> Damn shame what them diamonds did to you and beans. How you know about that? They robbed Mr. Johnson. Shot beans while y'all were running away. Y'all were lucky that day. You were there? Like I said, so many times in the past, I could have killed you. I know you want to go to Harlem. You want to play on that main kick? You do what I say do, and you can go. You don't you die. My deal ain't negotiable. You don't fit where I feel a color man should be. So I ain't asking you. I'm telling you. You could choose life. You could choose death.
I missed you last night. You know, it's funny. I went to Club Domino last night to have a good time. and came out two minutes short. Men like tugboat and bones are hard to replace. Sorry about your loss, wife. You know, I didn't forget about the money that you owe me from fronting that ridiculous little moonshine operation. <laughs> Bootlegging that shit from down south, huh? <laughs> oh, and just because you got pinched, don't think that that cancels your debt. Look, Spider, I want to pay you back what I owe you, All right? I'm just getting back on my feet. I just got home last night. Oh. I know you're going to pay me back, Trip. I'm not Father Divine. I don't give nothing away for free. Even beatings are earned, Trip. I mean, you can repay me by replacing the men I lost. What? <laughs> the way I figured, you knew what happened to the men last night. That makes you responsible. Spider. I ain't gonna kill nobody, all right? I didn't say you killed them. Something you wanna share with me, Trip? I ain't seen nothing, all right? But you and your fine-ass wife sure left in a hurry. But that's okay. You don't have to talk. I think it was Mississippi Black. And I'm gonna deal with him. But as far as your debt is concerned, with interest, annual inflation, you owe me $10,000. 10000 I didn't borrow much to begin with, Spider. What are you talking about? You got a problem with my arrangement trip? Spider, I don't got that kind of money, all right? I'll tell you what. You can work it off for me. You can replace the men I lost. I just got out. Ain't trying to go back in, okay? Well, if you give me $10,000 in three days, you don't have to. Otherwise, you better tell your wife to find another trumpet player to play taps at your funeral. In three days, I'm going to follow up with you. For my money, your services, or your life. You understand the trip? 